Right, so before this video begins, you might be a little confused if you don't know who Sad Gaming is. Sad Gaming was probably one of the biggest Isle Royale streamers slash, you know, YouTubers. And recently, I believe early December, his channel just suddenly disappeared and uh, a lot of his fans were trying to figure out why. But the reason it was so odd that Sad Gaming's channel disappeared is because he had like... I don't know how many exactly because his channel has gone now. You can't even check how many subscribers he was at. But I believe it was around 70,000. Okay, he hasn't just hit 100k yet. But I believe he was like 60k, 70k, 50k. It was somewhere around there. Which is a lot of subscribers, alright. He, he had built up a really big YouTube channel that would have been earning a lot of money. And that's why it's so kind of hard to believe that someone with that much popularity and and sort of like skill in the game that he would just quit randomly. You know, Sad Gamer's channel, it, it would have been making a lot of money and it could have been like a job for him in the future. Like I don't know how many how much exactly he was making, but with the amount of views he was getting, which was a lot, um, he he would have been making a decent amount, alright? We're talking quite a bit. I believe the reasoning for him deleting his channel or hiding it, I'm not really quite sure which one, if he deleted his channel or he's hid it. Which by the way, I still don't even know if you can hide your YouTube channel, but some people have told me that he could have just hid it. And possibly he could return in 2020, no one actually knows. I've tried to research on why Sad Gaming has like disappeared and why he stopped. And most of the videos, they're not very clear. He's going to be starting college, so he wants to focus on that, uh, which is reasonable, okay? We, you know, to drop YouTube for a while and, you know, focus on college for your future, that is completely reasonable. But why he would then delete his channel, which is making a lot of money to help him, you know, buy an apartment or you know help get food and stuff just in his spare time is sort of ridiculous but I'm sure he had good reasons for why but also another reason which is kind of crazy and this is true I feel bad for the guy really apparently a hacker got a lot of information about his like personal life or something along those lines and uh yeah, they were threatening to leak personal information to all of his fans and all that which obviously wouldn't have been good you know, like I said, I don't know if this is true or not. This is sort of just a rumor. Like, I've seen some videos on YouTube explaining it, and apparently they've messaged Sad's friends, and that's apparently what's been happening. A hacker had Sad's, like, in real life information, and the hacker was threatening to leak it for whatever reason. Apparently then Sad has deleted his channel over it because, you know, he's starting, he's starting a new school, and it looked like that was why... He, uh, he just didn't want to continue anymore. But anyway, okay, now that I've updated you, just in case you didn't know who Sad Gaming was, I'm now going to explain something that is really weird. I sort of secretly predicted Sad Gaming's disappearance, uh, like, a few days sort of after he disappeared. I didn't know he disappeared until, like, the 15th of December. He disappeared on like the 5th or something, but I didn't know. Okay, so you've got to believe me on this. But basically, I mean, I've even got proof here on Discord. I said, has anyone got info on side game disappearance? This is as soon as I found out on the 5th, on the, whatever the day is, uh, on the Discord post. That is as soon as I figured that side game disappeared. Because I was shocked, alright? He was a really big sort of YouTuber on um, the Roblox community. And it was just weird for me to see him just gone like that. Right, so on the 16th of December, as you can see, I have posted on my Discord server, Sad Gaming deleted his YouTube channel, does anyone have info on this? Okay, this is as soon as I figured out that Sad Gaming's channel was disappeared, alright? Um, so this is my sort of proof on when I figured it out. As you can see, it doesn't say it's edited or anything like that. So yeah, that is as soon as I, fi as soon as I figured it out, I went straight to my Discord and I asked, alright? So I figured out that Sad Gaming disappeared on the 16th of December and I uploaded a video called Roblox is Illuminati on the 8th of December, okay? I didn't know Sad Gaming disappeared 
he disappeared on the 5th. I uploaded this video on the 8th. So this is a few days after. Um, so you, you've just got to sort of believe me, all right? I didn't know. But in this video, I do like an intro voice uh, of a robot explaining, you know, to sort of, I mean, to sort of gain likes, all right? I'll play it now and hopefully you might be able to see uh, the uh, the prediction. If you do not leave a like in the next 10 seconds, then I will snap my robotic fingers and a quarter of the Roblox population will cease to exist. Trust me, you don't want that because all the island Roy noobs would disappear and that would be a sad day for humanity. Right, so 13 seconds into the video of Roblox's Illuminati, I basically made like a little skit thing at the start of the video explaining if you don't leave a like, a quarter of the Roblox population will cease to exist. As some of you may know, I'm sort of a Marvel nerd and uh, that's sort of like a reference from uh, Thanos in uh, Infinity War, just in case you didn't know, all right? It's a great film, check it out. I made a reference from Infinity War saying if you don't leave a like, a quarter of the Roblox population will disappear. And to make this even worse, when I edited this video, which by the way, I edited this video way before Sad even um, disappeared, okay? This video released on the 8th. I edited this video before the 5th when he disappeared because this video took a while to edit, all right? This video took through a couple of days to edit. So I was editing this before Sad even disappeared. And I put where it says Island Rail Noobs in the intro, I put Sad, all right? Right in the bottom left corner because I thought that that would be a funny little thing because everyone knows Sad is not an Island Rail Noob, okay? he's the best basically I mean if I have to pick the best player in Island Rail it would be sad gaming because that guy is nuts at the game everyone knows that but I put Island Rail noobs and I put sad gaming in the corner for like a little funny joke I just thought that was sort of crazy to see that I made this intro like this with sads actually in the intro I remember adding him in not even knowing he's gone and I just found, I just think that is sort of crazy um, that this has actually happened. So, uh, yeah. So, I mean, I guess the moral of the story, people, if you ever see an intro that sort of is trying to trick you into giving them likes, just like the video, all right? Because <laughs> somebody didn't like my Roblox's Illuminati video and Sad Gaming has disappeared. I did warn you. All right, I literally said in the intro, I just find it so funny. Like how I put in the next video, I will snap my Roblox fingers, a quarter of the Roblox population will disappear. And Sad Gaming disappeared because Jim Bob didn't like the video.